I'm going to tell you my story about something that I did. Okay, so um, so Roger was invited to Dallas, Texas, to get a drive-in movie award, which was a hubcap, and um, this was in the nineteen nineteen maybe around nineteen. Eighty. Anyway, so Roger was invited to get this award, and word came through the secretary of the director of the festival, the Drive-In Film Festival in Dallas, that shopping trips had been planned for Mrs. Corman. Now, I think at a previous time, and this is why I say that it, it has to do with how the woman reacts as much as how society is. So that was a common way of society looking at Mrs. Corman, right? Shopping trips. But by that time, I think I'd produced about 10 or 12 films and I had a certain amount of confidence. And instead of being offended or withdrawing or saying, oh, thank you very much and going shopping, I said, well, that's very kind of them, but would you please send word back from Mrs. Corman that Mrs. Corman is more interested in co-production deals. Well, Dallas opened up with people who were interested in co-production deals and I ended up making two films there. The Dirt Bike Kid and oh, actually getting the financing in that direction from DA uh, for DA, which I made in Ireland, but with Film Dallas Pictures financing. So I think it's, it's important to um, ask for what you want because otherwise you're not going to get it. I like that. Is there a certain way to ask for it? <laughs> well, I don't know. That was the way I asked for it, and that's what happened. So instead of being mad about it, it was just a very right. gracious, you know, no thank you, and then put out what you did want. And I didn't that. say no. I oh, said I more interested in co-production deals than shopping trips. Right, right. But thank you very much. Mm -hmm.